we were inspired by Anne Fredette, who was a previous Golden Apple teacher winner, and she was also Garrett's teacher, our son's teacher. And so my comment back to Kim when I found out all this was, wow, if, if an organization can represent and acknowledge someone like Anne, that's some that's an organization we want to be a part of. So that's really how it was, that's how it all started. Um, and then I was inspired to serve on the Golden Apple Selection Committee, really based on the fact that I was impressed with the process and the organization and the purpose. In watching our program and myself be honored, he knew that that was something he wanted to be part of, which was just a true explanation of Gary and how kind he is. The community is such a central part of education. A lot of times I think we think that it's just the school's responsibility and just the teacher's responsibility to educate our children, but we can't do this without community members. We have noticed because we are involved that other people are looking to get more involved and I think that Champions for Learning is a good opportunity for them and we've tried to recruit our friends and associates to, to also get involved. Well, we've seen the importance of education and we've seen that um, having a, an organization like Champions for Learning that's so effective at helping students. Um, we're lucky enough to be able to get the resources for our children, but a lot of parent, parents don't have the resources and I think that's what has made us so passionate about Champions is that they're serving so many families and so many students that might not otherwise get that kind of help and support. They are a couple that are phenomenal parents, yes, community members, but mostly they love to give back. They're genuinely great people. I would like to leave a legacy through education that I think everybody is welcome and there is something for everyone in the, in the school system and, and is available to help. Uh, Kim and I are humbled by the honor to be named champions. It's not something that I ever imagined or ever even thought about, um, but we're certainly honored and um, humbled by the recognition and hope that we can inspire others um, to work with the organization and work with champions um, to serve our kids. We just enjoy helping students because of everything that we've received from Collier County and our son, of course, and we couldn't have done it without the support of, of the school system. So we're just feel really blessed to have, have that and to be able to give back a little bit. Well, hopefully we, um, we impress on the community that um, we're in this together and that um, together we can accomplish great things. Mm -hmm.